like beadwork from the Phoenix Collection. It's from the Shamit Collection. Very sharp. lecture hall desk. These books don't look familiar. Cheap copy of a Siamese idol. been searching for. Strange looking thing. I wonder where Marcus picked it up. my key? You bet I did. Take a look. What are you waiting for? Let's open it. Why not? It's an obvious fake. I 
I believe we are opening a new chapter in history. My word, India, a small metal bead, jewellery perhaps? I still think it's a fake. Then you won't mind if I take it. Ready, Mr. Smith. Stand back, gentlemen. I hope you've got a getaway car waiting. You'll need one. He got away. But we got his coat, Marcus. Hey, what's this? Klaus Kerner, huh? Good Lord, Indy, the man's some sort of agent from the Third Reich. What does the spy want with the Buddhist statue? <sighs> I lied, Marcus. I don't think it's a phony. I can't place the style, but it's old. Look what else our friend was carrying. An old copy of National Archaeology, and there you are in Iceland. Yeah, field supervisor for the Jastro expedition. My first real job. Who's the woman? Sophia Hapgood. She was my assistant. A spoiled rich kid from Boston, rebelling against her family. Where is she now? She gave up archaeology to become a psychic. How odd. You can say that again. Indy, Kerner found you. What if he finds her? We should warn her. I want to know more about that statue. You know, Marcus, the coldest year of my life was the one I spent in Iceland with Sophia. 